emphasize to the teachers and to all the students the importance of being very careful outside. Hi, I'm Phil Grice. For almost 50 years, I've been a cinematographer working mostly on documentary films. Prior to my career, I was an elementary school teacher for three years, full-time, employed by the New York State, New York City Board of Education. During my third year, I taught at the school behind me, the Rafael Hernandez Langston Hughes Public School 30. During the spring of 1970, I decided to make a direct cinema approach documentary, a day in the life of this Harlem Elementary School. What happens in a classroom? How do the children behave during lunchtime, in the play yard, their songs, unusual aspects of discipline, especially at that time, administration policy, all of that I tried to capture so that uh, one would come away with being a fly on the wall. We're going back to 1969, 1970, when decentralization was in its infancy in Harlem. It created lots of challenges for administration, for teachers, and for the New York City Board of Education itself. I realized that Harlem School 1970 has a lot to offer in terms of a social document. We're looking at a day in the life of a Harlem school almost a half a century ago. Harlem School. 1970.